It was a keenly contested matchup between St. Kitts and St. Vincent and the Grenadines in the 2018 ECCB sponsored OECS Under 23 Netball Competition at the Pam Tyson Netball Courts in Bastyr, St. Kitts. In the end, the hosts prevailed with a 36 32 victory, much with the delight of the home crowd. The game started at fast pace with both teams going at each other scoring one after the other. However, St. Kitts pulled away in the second half and despite changes by St. Vincent to match up with the home side, in the end, they ended up with the victory. Knowing how crucial this game was considering that St. Vincent was one of the favorites, the young netballers celebrated at the end of the match. <laughs> Aliyah Gibson top scored with 34 points from 53 attempts, while John L. John of St. Vincent scored 17 from 41 attempts. St. Kitts coach Michelle French said she was proud of her girls in how they performed on the court. Settle down, at every center pass they must shoot. Everybody mark their man, defend, and the attackers must attack, must defend as well. We have to, we had to adjust too as well. It take us a while to get back into the game after the rain came, and um, the, the girls were really pushing for the win, so they went out and did their best. Godfrey Harry, coach of the St. Vincent team, said his players had an off night. I just think it's just a fall off the game plan and so on. Um, I don't think it's anything that um, can't be fixed. Um, I think it's played well. Um, I must congratulate them for that. Um, we could have played better. As I said, we had some some falters on our game plan. In the evening's other matches, Dominica coming off the disappointment of Saturday's aborted match bounced back to defeat Antigua and Barbuda 29-18. V Fontaine top scored with 22 points for the winners. Dominica's coach Dinia Joseph is pleased with her team's performance. Last night's situation was unfortunate, but we came out today resilient and came back in good spirit and left yesterday behind and we concentrated on what was happening and we were focused as we should be and I commend my team for what they have done in terms of their basic team, in terms of their performance. Meanwhile, St. Lucia crushed Nevis 89-7. Ayanna Hippolit finished with 42 points from 52 attempts, and her teammate Dasha Eugene finished with 30 points from 45 attempts. Evelou Lenore also had a good game with 17 from 34 attempts. Coach Alexandra Eugene of St. Lucia believes Sunday night's performance was much better than on the opening night. Tonight, my girls performed as expected, and the almost achieved their goal. Um, our goal was to have a hundred over Davis, but we came short of that, but I am still very proud of them. Um, and so I'm expecting them to continue that kind of play for the rest of the tournament. Matches continue on Monday with St. Vincent and the Grenadines playing Dominica at 6.15 p.m. on Court 1, while on Court 2, at the same time, St. Lucia will be playing Antigua and Barbuda at 7.30 p.m. St. Kitts will take on Nevis.